Oh, guys, it's really cold out. This hood does not want to go down any farther. Um, it's 54 degrees out, and it's rainy, and it doesn't, it's not nice, but we have to go to town again. We have to get back to the bank today because Mom has some things that they have to do there. And I'm just, we're going to shop afterwards, and I'm working on my thing that I was filing the other day. I got a new file yesterday whenever we were in town. So I'm going to work on that, and I will see you all probably when we're in the truck going to town. So, guys, we went to the bank. We got that done. We went to Foodland. We got tomatoes. We're going to Bubba's again. This is kind of repetitive of yesterday. Um, But, yeah, we're going to Bubba's. Then me and Willie have scheduled a hunting date tomorrow, so we're going to go hunting tomorrow for our squirrel squirrel and yeah mom will be back in a second and she's i think putting stuff in the back of the truck i'm not sure okay so we're headed out of town now huh we're headed out of town now thank god oh, this is labor day weekend and it's like demolition derby in town yeah. i'm sitting at a stoplight and i feel like a sitting duck that's the only time people hit me is when i'm sitting still <laughs> No, in fact, every time that I was in a so-called accident was because somebody ran into me. I was sitting still. Oh, here we go. I thought that car was going straight there for a minute. It's like, yeah, what? That's what I thought, too. Oh. It is freezing. It is. It says 53. It says 53, but eh. It's 51 when we came in town, so I'm going to still say it's 51. Well, we got to never trust the bank. Yeah, I don't trust I've always been told that throughout all of my years growing up. And I thought things were better. Wrong. <laughs> Back in my grandparents' day and age, when they put their money in the bank, they went through a depression and ended up losing what money they had in the bank. Wasn't a good thing. I'm beginning to wonder if it's not coming back around again. We had to go for CDs that matured. And the woman gives you no paperwork, nothing, not one thing. It's like, oh, I don't like this. If you don't have any paperwork to back up what she's telling you, everything that comes out of her mouth would be a lie. Because you could go back in and she'd say, I never said that. Mark my words, if you don't have that piece of paper with what they're telling you to be true, don't do it. If it feels bad, it is bad. And money market accounts, don't trust them. They lend out all that stuff to all those different people. And then they say, oh, the bank's going to back it up. It's FDIC regulated. But we have no paperwork to give you on that. So where's your money going? You might as well just hand it to a bum on the street. He'd be happier. <laughs> not good. No, it's not. And my um, original shirt that I had on today that I started out with got wet, so I had to put this jacket on and just start wearing it. I've got a t-shirt underneath of it, but... Yeah. It's How been... Tomorrow, I'm hoping to stay home. Also, I got an email that my hunting license is going to be sent out in the mail. Yay! So, I got that last night, and her and Lifetime. Dad... Lifetime, you must specify. Yes. Lifetime. Her and Dad were talking, and I interrupted them telling them about this. So, we're going to do that. I got a copy off an email tonight about, I think it's bird hunting I have to sign. I'm not sure. I think it's bird hunting. If you know anybody that is getting their lifetime license, make sure they do it before they're two years old. Even if they're never going to hunt, get those licenses then. They're a lot cheaper. They are. I had to pay $811. Of course, I got the duplicate license. That means you can have one somewhere else and carry one on you. But regular um, lifetime hunting license in our state is $800 and what was it? $6? $5? $806. Yeah, $806 or $5 for anybody that's over the age of two. If you get them before the age of two, they're like 200 and something. Yeah. It should be cheaper for the older people. 
it should be cheaper when you're close teenagers, between 15 and 17. Exactly. Because you know what you want to do about hunting. When you're two years old, you don't know if you're going to pick up a gun and kill something. I would hope they didn't. <laughs> exactly. But yeah, that's really dumb. What are you supposed to be able to kill? I got um, hunting, fishing, and I think trapping. I got ABL. I know that. But tomorrow. Squirrel. Oh dear. You have to take 10 squirrels to make a pot of anything. <laughs> I don't know. It's fun to just go out in the woods. Yeah, and... it is. You need that time. Yeah. You'll be in God's world then, and He'll protect you. Yeah. Are those snowflakes hitting the windshield? I don't Look know. At that. They're splattered. Me and Will have arranged this, so we got bullets tonight. I got CO2 for my pistol, just in case I take it. I got a gun. He got a gun that's finally working. He had to saw his gun off because it got the barrel got bent on the end. So his gun sawed off, and I don't know how big it is. We're going to attempt to do that tomorrow. If it's supposed to be like this, I'm going to freeze. <laughs> But, yeah, that's what we're doing, so we'll see you all when we get home. So, guys, it's really early in the morning right now. Well, it's not really early. It's kind of like almost 7. I've been up since 6.30. Willie and me have been texting back and forth. Mom's still asleep. I've got my stuff to go hunting with. And I'm going to edit this because I've got to wait a little bit until Willie gets ready. And then we will be out of here. So I will see you all tomorrow. Until next time, guys, have fun. Be safe. I'll see y'all later.